Alrighty, welcome back to another episode of Australian Outdoor Man. We're just going to quickly show you guys uh, some homemade sausage rolls. So what I've done here, I've just got a couple of sausages, which you tend to always have when you're out camping. Uh, I just cut them open, just like this. Throw them in a little bowl, take the skins off. Uh, I've added just a little bit of cheese in as well. So I've just used a pizza blend cheese. Put them in a bowl, mush them up. Mix them around. I just thought it'd be a good idea. We usually, when we go camping, you get a little bit sick and tired of uh, pretty much just bacon, sausages, steak, a couple of veggies. So we've come up with this idea just to make the homemade sausage rolls. We usually do them in uh, the camp oven over hot coals or uh, in the Weber if we're lucky enough to have our Weber with us. So that's... That's the camp oven there. What I usually do is just use a trivet and then a little bit of baking paper as well, which I find very handy. I usually do about 20% of the coals on the bottom and then about 80% of the coals on top of the uh, camp oven. And um, it takes about 20 minutes and you're done. So I'll quickly do this, just a sausage. I usually just lay it out. I find um, four sausages usually is enough to do um, one sheet of your pastry. So I usually just lay it out onto the pastry. I've put a little bit of chilli in here. Um, you can add whatever you like, any, any type of herbs that you like. It's very quick. We've uh, the um, Weber, I, I usually like to pre that for about 20 minutes um, on high, and I usually put the stone in there. Um, that you can either use a pizza stone or you can use the tray and the trivet just to keep that indirect heat off them so you don't burn the bums of them. But usually, a lot of this stuff you have when you go camping as well, even if um, usually you've got eggs, sausages. Uh, whoever's lucky enough to have a freezer, you got your pastry in there. Well, usually you just roll it up, get your egg, and give that a quick, quick whisk up. Like I said, there, just nice and quick in the Weber. It's usually about 15 minutes as well, um, 15 to 20 minutes. Once you get to your roll and it's completed, you just, just paint it just a little bit of butter, uh, sorry, a bit of egg. On there you can use butter as well. Um, we tend to have eggs because of the chickens. So we've always got lots of fresh eggs, which is great. And as long as you continue your roll, so it closes up underneath, you shouldn't have any problems. So that's one done there already. Like I said, any sausages, pork, chicken, beef, you can um, you use any of them, it's just handy when you've got the leftovers and you're camping. Good little treat, I love them. Like I said, they're nice and easy to do. What I usually do is paint the outside as well, just with a little bit of butter and um, put some sesame seeds on there. So if you've got bacon as well, that is always really yummy to put in there, or some ham. Same again. Like I said, you can use um, egg or butter. I tend to use egg, I find it sticks a little bit better. Oops. And that's it. 
and you can go through, chop them to whatever size you like. Paint them up with your egg. Put them in your Dutch oven or into your Weber. Cook them up and uh, enjoy with a nice cold beer or a wine. Like I said, they are very, very quick to make. We'll go put these into the weather today. There you go, done. We'll go put these into the weather for about 20 minutes. That's been preheating. Uh, we'll take a couple of shots when it's cooking. We'll get back and uh, we'll taste, taste one. All right, guys, see you soon. All right, guys, welcome back. It's been about 20 minutes now. Uh, all the sausage rolls have done. I'll give you a quick look at that. These aren't too bad, they've turned out pretty good. Nice, quick and simple homemade sausage rolls right there. Like I said, any type of sausage is fine to use, nice and quick. Just get your pastry, roll it all up, your homemade sausage rolls, especially when you're camping. Uh, caravanning, travelling around, these are brilliant. Like I said, you cook them in your Dutch oven, your camp oven, anything like that. Any questions, just chuck in the comments down below. I'll get back to you straight away. Uh, thanks for watching another episode of Australian Outdoor Man. Hope you guys all take care, look after yourself, and be good. Cheers. They do look bloody yum. Oh, oh. that's so good. I think the chicken's, chicken's my favourite. Chicken, pork and then beef. Or oh, lamb and beef. Oh, yum. Mmm. So crunchy.